Princess Day or Sundays with Jim and Terry. Now, I would have worn my shirt, but I need, I want to wear my bib here. <laughs> Not my bib, my apron. <laughs> and who made the shirts? <laughs> my father-in-law, Gary from Ogi Guy. Check out his channel. Um, definitely go and visit him. He's got some great videos. And the but videos, actually, actually the videos are for older people. Yeah, for or technology um, challenged and just easy programs. He's an Apple guy. He does a lot of things with Apple. So um, if that's something you have with your iPads or with an Apple phone, he has some great videos. So thank you, Dad, for making those shirts. And I will wear mine next time. Um, so that's Wisconsin Dells next yeah. time. So we're making um, kind of like our version of a Monte Cristo sandwich, <laughs> but I'm using this sandwich maker here. And uh, what you do is you just spray it with, and as you need it, you spray it again with cooking spray, just regular here, Pam, any cooking spray will do. And you just close that lid, it has a little handle on it, and you let that heat up. When the light goes off, then it's, it's ready to go. So while we're letting it heat up, we're first going to make um, the, the Disney, we're talking about that, the Disney Monte Cristo sandwich is, I think, just ham and cheese that's inside, um, Swiss cheese. And so we're just going to kind of do that version of it. But the original way to make, and I've done this in restaurants when I used to work for a restaurant, is piece of bread, then you go piece of ham, a piece of cheese, a piece of bread, a piece of ham, a piece of cheese, oh, like and a later. piece of bread, and then you seal it, you dip it into egg batter, yeah, and then you make your Monte Cristo that way. Yeah. So, how are you going to do it? I'm just, I'm not dipping in any egg or anything. I'm just using the just the sandwich maker um, as it is. I think I'll probably put two layers of cheese and two layers of ham, make it a little bit more. So then, see the light just popped off. We're also gonna do. Now you could um, you could put like butter on there if you wanted to, you know, put more moisture in. There. Actually, you can actually use mayonnaise instead of butter. Yeah. If you're a mayonnaise freak, because yeah. you can do that with the same thing with, oh, look at that. So we're just going to put one in now. Okay. And then you just close that down. Okay, and then just put that little handle on there. That keeps it closed. And we'll check it. Ah, uh, it doesn't take that long, like two to three minutes maybe. Not that long at all. So let me get a plate out for Jim. I want him to try one. The only thing we did, I thought we had was powdered sugar, but that's, if, I mean, if you want powdered sugar, but I did get strawberry jam and blueberry, and then there's blackberry jam too. So normally that's what, um, but honestly the best powdered sugar jams are from Nutsberry Farm, mm -hmm. California. Yeah. Oh, what is this? That is cherry pie filling. Interesting. What are you going to do with the cherry pie filling? Oh, right? So you notice that when we put it in that sandwich maker, it already made a crease in it. So that you don't even cut it in half. You don't have to worry. Well, you have to cut it in half, but I mean, like, you can. So, Terry, quick question. What if you put it into egg batter? and you put it into that device, what would happen? It'd be fine, you could do that. Because my waffle maker is the same thing. You, you're you putting liquid in there. So a true Monte Cristo is with egg batter. Yeah. Why don't you mix some eggs up and uh, try one? I am gonna try one. Let's try this first. This is more of a grilled cheese ham sandwich, which I'm thinking that what it yeah. is. So yeah, try this and see, and we'll make the next one. We'll make, like you said, get a couple eggs. Yeah, so we're looking at Swiss cheese and ham, and you can't beat it. 
Pickers, what do you think? Yeah, I think so too. I think we should go a step further. Okay, so let's try that. <clears throat> I do buy brown eggs more than white. Mm -hmm. I think consistently, I just enjoy a brown egg more than I do for a white egg. The shells are a lot thicker, I've noticed. It's just a little bit different when you make, um, when you make uh, hard boiled eggs with brown eggs. Don't they take, take longer? I, I don't know. Oh, well, they'd have to because of the shells, yeah. yeah. So let me take a quick bite here. They're delicious for a ham and cheese sandwich. Okay. Let's step it up. Okay. Another one. Ham. Let me grab another piece of cheese. You like the dessert ones because I have something. We're going to use a different another, bread. And put another piece of cheese on top of that. Another one? Yep. Okay. Just cheese it up. Okay. Okay, this is going to be interesting. I probably should have had it like a. Why don't you move the eggs out of the way and pour it into that dish, that plate right here, hon? Get the yeah. eggs, put them right here. No, put them, in, put them here. Oh, yeah, let's, yeah. Yep, there you go. Okay. Put the eggs in here. That's a good idea. There you go. Oops, can you move that? Thank you. Oh, look at that. Oh. On, and also on the sides and yep. four corners. Arizona, yeah. New Mexico, <laughs> Nevada, <laughs> and Utah. Okay. Here we go. And let's do three minutes. So we're gonna do till the light finishes an extra minute. Get my hands are all We could do probably one more. <clears throat> we haven't even put jam on it yet. No. Because we haven't pumped up the jam, pump it up. Which pump. one do you want? Raspberry. No, this is oh, blackberry. blackberry. I, they didn't, yeah. Well, no, I don't. I want blackberry. I don't want strawberry. No. Yeah, I have strawberry and. Um, that's what you. Well, I need a plate. Here. Here you go. Okay. Let's. Uh, Hold on. Take a do it. Okay. Okay. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. Another sip. Put them yeah. in there for like. 30 more seconds. Yeah. Oh. yeah, you don't really need to close it all the way. Just close it. It's it latches. My jam on my plate. What do they say in, start, in uh, space balls? We need to jam the radar. Jam the radar. Oh, look at that. 
It's like a French toast Monte Cristo. Look at that. I like that. It's delicious. I might not even be ready for my steak tonight. Yeah. That looks oh. <laughs> oh, that looks good, Terry. Here we go. Oh. No powdered sugar, huh? No powdered sugar. I thought we had some. <clears throat> Here's a knife. But that's what's missing. Let's see. <clears throat> I don't want to waste this egg. So we have, um, again, she put, oh, look at that. This is amazing. This is great. I mean, there's no effort involved. Just taking the stupid thing out and mm -hmm. making it. I'll wait to see. It's a good one. Yeah, I'm going to make one more, one. and then we're going to do a dessert version. Obviously not. This is a dessert food. version. But I think I saw some Nutella. Mm -hmm. Is it called Nutella or Nutella? Nutella. Nutella. Ooh. Ear piercing. Sorry, guys. <laughs> that was awful. That's the worst. <laughs> okay, it's hot. It's but it's gorgeous. Oh man. Put some of this on him. Just like Disneyland. Is it? <laughs> I think they use like a brioche. Oh, this bread. is actually, this is really good. This is this breakfast. Is just, this is just this is breakfast. whole wheat. This is whole wheat bread. But you can use, try, try different breads, French bread, whatever you want. But the thing doesn't close very well. If you use like a Texas toast, it would not work. Yeah. You need to use regular bread for it. This is delicious. Oh my goodness. Oh. Yeah, like a French bread would be good. The brioche bread, I think is okay. I think it's, you can get it, it's not thick. Oh, so good. <clears throat> oh. I don't know if I'm hungry or this is just really good, but this <laughs> is just delicious. Look, Dad, no mess on the shirt. Not yet. I well, think that's no. maybe that's for Ethan White. Oh, hold on. Sorry, folks. Oh, you're doing fine. Cherish couldn't open a frozen banana. Why are you doing this? I want to eat dinner. <laughs> oh, goodness sake. This is so good. This is like... Going to Knott's Berry Farm. I'm getting lunch before you go on a big ride. <laughs> mm. Why do so many different things taste so good together? It's not natural. It's like somebody said you can put chocolate, ice cream, and sea salt and butterscotch together, and it tastes amazing, which I haven't tried that. I'm not much of a chocolate. I'm more of a vanilla guy, but um, anyway. Okay. Charlie's is coming out pretty quick. And I think I will finish this one that uh, she made me, and then I have to have dinner tonight. Maybe a little bit longer. <laughs> this is so good. This is this. I don't know if it's just the jam that makes everything good. I think you put jam on a pork chop. <laughs> Actually, mint, yeah, was it mint jelly with pork? Yeah, well, it's lamb. But oh, lamb. This is so good. Oh, wow. 
Oh, Terry just pulled out raisin bread. What is that? Cranberry bread? No. It is cinnamon. Cinnamon swirl. Cinnamon swirl. <laughs> that noise. <laughs> wow. Dogs yell at me later on. There you go. You can do two at a time, but... Why? Uh, Just let that next person wait. Yeah. Okay. So, the next one we're going to do... Get a spoon. We're going to try the cinnamon bread first with the cherry pie filling. So, it's almost going to be like... Like a turnover. You get those turnovers, like, what fast food restaurant serves turnovers? Well, when I used to work for Millie's, it was, um, Cobbler. Yeah, but these um, are like... Tur but what's a turnover? What's the well, definition of a turnover? There's apple pies. Like, sometimes you get those apple pies. But what's the definition of a turnover? Hmm. It's a pie. It's just... a triangle. Oh, okay. <laughs> In the shape of a triangle, I think, is a turnover. Okay, let me do a little bit. Now, what's uh, later on? I'll tell you about this. I'm just gonna do it just a little bit of spray, but you know what? You don't need too much in there. And oh, the cleanup is so easy. If you dip it, if you so dip it in egg, it'd be so much better. Yeah, we'll just try it this way. Okay, first one. Okay, the next one I'm gonna do. is Nutella and banana. That one's cooking away. Now for me, I've never had Nutella, but I've had had a banana. Had had? I've had. Should had, I? I? I have had. Banana. Do you want me to do uh, just Nutella? No, just go the for it and knock it out. Knock it out of the park. You're in the way there, can. Okay. Oh, My kids love this stuff on toast. I've never had it, and there's no reason why I would. And they sell the little Nutella packets with little cookie things with it. You dip your cookie in there. They're little individual Nutella packs. Okay. Probably should have. I don't think you should ruin it. Well, no, go ahead. Let's just try it. Uh, it's, you know. If you don't like it, I'll eat it. And then I could put one with just Nutella. You know, why don't you put Nutella on the other side too? Yeah, okay. So if most of you know what Nutella is, but those of you that don't, it's chocolate, a chocolate and hazelnut, hazelnut spread. And Nutella is the best. I've had others, like off brands, and it didn't. It's not Wouldn't the same. that be like a uh, Nutella? Would be like a uh, chocolate frosting for a cake. You could. Same texture. It's, no, because it's more the consistency of creamy peanut butter. What's oh, frosting okay. is a little more. Well, I mean, there's whipped frosting. Would be good. I think we're gonna need another plate. We're gonna need a bigger boat. It's okay, I just did dishes, so. By the way, these are expensive dishes from Ikea. So uh, I'll put the link down if you guys are looking <laughs> for some expensive plates. Okay, chase this around. Okay. Uh, not too impressed with that one. I think the money Crystal you should have gave me last. Cause that just knocked it out of the park. This one is like a um, it's dessert. A turnover. 
Whatever a turnover means. Yeah. Well, don't see. give it to me for lunch tomorrow. Don't. Well, I'll try it. No, well, you're using it. I mean, I'm going to eat it. Yeah, I'm going to have half and give you half. But I'll eat the other one too later on. <laughs> They're so good. <laughs> this is a great idea, Terry. That's very hot. You know, this is wait. a lot better than your Indian oh, no, that's throat right. choker meal you made. That was hot. That was awful. Okay. Yeah, let that cool. Now I'm going to taste mine. See if it's the difference between this is a ham and cheese. Yep. I did another one. Like Jim's. Hey, oh, no, put the jam on it. Hmm. What are you doing? Hmm. Oh, put the jam on it. That one's empty. Waste not one. Noise is. Get rid of that noise and uh, we'll be fine. There we go. That's some. Get, get, a, get a new one. Get a new one. Yeah. That's ridiculous. God created bottles with a square edge so you can buy a new bottle and not have to waste the time to get everything out of it. Right, Pegas? It's actually a round edge, not a square. <laughs> right, Pegas? Get some more, uh, get some more of this right there. Put some more in there. Yeah. Okay. You're gonna have to open it. What are you doing? I wanna hear it. My hand. Yeah, do it. Come in. My hand is wet. Oh, there we go. Wonder Woman. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Look at that. Oh, she got Oh, look at that now. Okay. Take a bite. It's better with the way the egg on it, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. See. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, well. Right. Now I'm wondering about the Nutella one and the uh, the cherry filling. Yeah. You sure you don't want to try it now? I'll try a little bit of the cherry. I'll cut it in half, and maybe I can have the other half for work. Unless you're gonna make a couple more, you know what? Let's make a couple more and. Uh, yeah, let me uh, get the chocolate them. one in, and I'm gonna cut that. I'll have it for breakfast know. instead of buying some Kroger donuts that last three days before I can use the hockey pucks. Yeah, I'll say Kroger Bakery is really good, but the donuts. Mm -hmm. Is that well, where you got those? Yeah, but they're not donut people. Okay. No, it wasn't Kroger. It was Walmart. Walmart, yeah. Hey, where's my? You want this? Yeah, want to try some? Not no, cut it, cut it in half. I don't want the whole thing. Yeah. I'm gonna take a little corner of it. I'm gonna try to just try one. It's a nice little bend on that. Look at that. Oh, and this is the cinnamon swirl. Mm -hmm. bread you can use uh, any bread you want whatever you feel like mm, wow this is really good okay I can't eat anymore <laughs> I want dinner but you can uh, you can wrap all that up and all eat it throughout my day it work Ooh. The next one I'll do cinnamon, but I'll just I'll just do one more. So I'm not sure about this because I've never had Nutella, Nutella. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna Nutella? do Nutella. 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 N U T. Never uh, had it. I'm just. Which I just think it's it's just um, chocolate frosting. That's what I think. You just kind of pass it off as a breakfast thing. But you know, of course, cake. Cake can be a breakfast thing. It's got eggs in it. That's right. It's got flour. It's like a pancake. So Grandma says, you can have cake for breakfast. You can have ice cream. For breakfast. Yes, you can. Put fruit topping on it. But not a popsicle. Yeah, I guess. 
Well, again, if it's an orange popsicle, I think orange juice, right? Yeah. If it's fruit popsicle. There you go. I used to make So my why candy. on earth are we eating eggs and bacon when we can have ice cream? I don't know. Ask yourself that question. This, I don't you know what? Know. Something's okay. wrong with our lives. This is just the Nutella. Now, you probably could do dip. I just didn't want to do any more, but you probably could do the dip it in egg as well. I think egg is a big factor in these these things mm -hmm. um, because it kind of packs everything in, and it becomes breakfast. <laughs> you well, know? No, seriously, it's like you know what. I'm going to have a, a piece of bread with some ham and cheese in it, and that's lunch. But then you say, you know what? Can you dip that in egg? It becomes breakfast. <laughs> there you go. I will say it has a um, uh, a better, I mean, it tastes good, but I mean, it adds that extra flavor on the outside of it. When yeah. You bite into yeah. It. It's, it's the Rocky Balboa of our life. We have yeah. to have those five eggs in the morning. Do you want to try the chocolate one? I will try a corner. Okay, I will try it. Give me a corner. It's really hot. Can't hand me your plate. My plate has jelly on it. Give me a new oh. plate. Go ahead and break out the new plates, hon. So you just washed them. Go ahead. No, we'll leave that alone. No, no. We'll just put it on. No, here. no, no. You're. Because that's uh, going to go in here. Okay, your... you're contaminating. <laughs> it's not. Okay, let's get rid of this for you. So there's the chocolate. That has the banana. Now you might not like the banana. No, I like bananas. I'm just saying it's it's just I never had Nutella. But this last one. It smells good. It smells um, very. Um, keep an eye on. It smells like something that I had before in Mexico. I could have sprayed that a little bit more. I think I smell the hazelnut in it. Yeah. Which, I'm not sure about that. I'd rather have hazelnut and coffee, which I don't drink very often. Well, I've had because we've had an abundance of hazelnut beans. Anyways, so let's try this out. This is Nutella with banana and swirled cinnamon. raisin bread. No, no raisin. Swirled cinnamon. Just cinnamon bread, yeah. That's good. He's converted. No, no, no. This is this is delicious. This is honey. This is. Wow. Wow. <laughs> um. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna stop. I gotta stop. I have to eat dinner. Yeah. I can't so eat this all this. Is, this crap. is my dinner, you guys. And you know, it's not dinner. This is snack. These are these are treats, <laughs> right? Yeah, you wouldn't. Be. You wouldn't. Well, these are no. No, I used to make the now. Uh, Carrie, the you cannot. Ones? You cannot eat these as dinner because it has, if the the, the Monte Cristo. Yes. Mm -hmm. These are not dinner. Oh no, the other ones are dessert. Yeah. Right. Right. Which is yeah. is killing me. My heart rate has gone up, and I feel back on my that pills. Sugar. <laughs> I don't so. eat. I don't eat things like this at all, ever. Mm -hmm. I think the last snack I had like this. Oh, I did get an apple pie from McDonald's about two weeks ago, and oh, I did buy donuts, but those donuts were kind of they're yeah. okay, but they were more sugary than anything else. These are amazing. Terry, you you um you and Sears have knocked <laughs> it out of the park. Oh, that's an eye. But unfortunately, we have a lot of you have a lot of work ahead of you to make me happy for my snacks when well, I get home from work. You can come uh get give me some ideas on something else that I could put in there. You know. Squid? <laughs> you you know it's funny. We could do a seafood one. How about a chorizo? Not chorizo. Uh, um oh 
a chorizo with bread and egg is like a bre- with cheese. It would be like a breakfast breakfast, a breakfast sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> like breakfast. Well, that would be great. So here's what you do. You get cheese, you get some chorizo in there, and you get the bread, you dip it in butter, not butter, in egg, and you put it in there. It would be like having a Mexican breakfast wrapped around your mouth, and then you start singing in Spanish. Instead of having it in a tortilla, you'd have yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, what about nice putting about a tortilla? What about putting kids? tortillas in there? You can, can you, can you put a tortilla? Mm. Why not? Could try it. You have to fold it. A sure. Way oh, yeah. it. Make it into a pocket. Well, you get. I mean, you could put a twelve-inch tortilla in there, fold it in half, and put all the fixings in there. Mm. We have we have tortilla. Why don't we try one? Now. Yeah. Okay. I gotta plug it back in. What do you want in there? Uh, we don't have chorizo. Never mind. Okay. We'll do that next time. But that would be okay. awesome because you can just like, you know, put these, all these flavors in there and make a, a breakfast burrito. You could. Yeah. What's nice about it is if, you, if you're if you a mom, you do this in the morning. Um, it, it doesn't, as you can tell, it doesn't take just the prep work, getting all the ingredients set out. And you ask your kids, what do you want? Do you want ham and cheese? Do you want to, you want to. You know, you know, you don't ask them. You just get it yeah. for them. Anyway, yeah. um, the cleanup for this, it, oh, sorry, let me just back a step. Once you cook them up, wrap them in foil, and it's to, to go breakfast or, you know, if it's a sandwich, they could, they would love this a sandwich. They can't heat it up. They'll still be good. Um, but the cleanup's really easy. You don't immerse this, you know, because it's all attached. You can't unplug this. So you let it cool completely. And all I do is take a wet paper towel and clean all the crumbs out. You got to clean all the corners around that because sometimes it oozes on the side. But basically, you just wipe it down with a wet paper towel. You don't put any soap or water on it. That's what keeps this grill so, like, it, not, it doesn't stick as much. But, you know, you only have to use this maybe twice the whole time, depending on how many sandwiches. The last one I should have sprayed one more time. But yeah, and you can do two at a time. I just did one at a time. And, um, but yeah. Maybe. Awesome. Yeah. Oh my goodness, awesome. Well, thanks so much oh. for stopping by and watching. We we hope to do more videos again. We got kind of lag behind here. and um, But we'll, it'll be Jim's turn. We'll see what he. No, he what's next with. week? Well, next week we're going to be in Wisconsin, Wisconsin Dells. So Jim's gonna be doing a lot of filming there. So and I will, I will videotape. I will videotape my breakfast, camping breakfast, um, mm -hmm. and um, what we done with the car, my Kia Sportage, and uh, how we got it hooked up and set up for camping. I put everything away today. It's all in there. All I've been waiting for is Terry to do her uh, finals, which is um, our linen and clothes. Um, everything I have in there is good for at least two weeks of camping, mm -hmm. but we're only going to do two days, one overnight thing. Uh, but we're going to do, um, a couple things. One thing for sure is going to be the Paul Bunyan restaurant and we're going to do it for dinner, I think. And I think we saw some things about, um, the, um, deer feeding, deer feeding the $5 tours. Upside down. Nice. And um, with the log cutters, but maybe not that one. We're, we'll figure it out. Anyways, um, please, as always, we want to ask subscribe, like, and uh, comment on our things. Uh, we always love to hear the comments from people. Right, Terry? Right. Oops. Yeah, definitely. Um, we, we're at 96, so thank you to the new subscriber. I, I'm sorry I forgot your name, but we're up to 96. We want to get to 100, and we... Let me tell you, share the video so that we can get that up because there's going to be a giveaway. Um, also, we're giving away our dog. <laughs> no, we're not. Um, hit that notification bell so that lets you know when the next video is that's up. A, that's a light. Yeah, but you're going to post it. Oh, bell okay. there. <laughs> Thanks so much, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Yeah, I, I just like having fun with it. Okay. Wow. Look at it.
him go. Better move it, man. You're not gonna make it. You hit two cones. Those could have been people. Those could have been guests at her wedding. They were cones. <laughs>